how to insert check boxes in microsoft excel hello everyone welcome to excel 10 tutorial in this quick tutorial i'm going to show you how you can insert check box in microsoft excel how you can rename it how you can copy it how you can move it resize it how you can link a check box to a cell how you can align your check box how you can group all your check box delete your check box in short i'm going to talk about everything you can do with check box in microsoft excel before starting i want you to take a moment and please subscribe to the channel it means a lot to me so let's get started first let's create a checkbox here to do that you'll have to click on the developer tab here click on insert and then click here form control checkbox okay now you can see the cursor has been changed so i am ready to insert the checkbox but before that if you don't have developer tab here you can check this video and learn how you can add developer tab to the ribbon okay so we are going to create our first checkbox here so this is our checkbox okay and it has a name and it's a shape and now there is another way you can add checkbox but you don't have to click on developer tab insert and checkbox every time you can add this option in your quick access toolbar and whenever you click it you can easily insert checkbox let's learn how you can do that here click on this arrow and select more comments and from here you can select all comments now you'll need to find the from control checkbox from this list you can see checkbox and from control select this not this one okay from control check box click add click ok it's in the quick access toolbar okay now select it ready to insert our checkbox you can see this is the second checkbox and we can create from this option now that we have our checkbox you can see we have names here checkbox 2 checkbox 3 and I'm, i don't want that i want to rename it or remove it so right click on the checkbox and select edit text and you can change the text or remove it from here okay another option select the checkbox by control click and simply remove the text there is another important part for checkbox if you click here it's automatically checking and unchecking selecting a checkbox is important and you can select a checkbox by pressing ctrl and then left click and you can select it okay so it's important you can also right click and then you can select the checkbox okay this is how we can select a checkbox now let's copy the checkbox right click on the cell copy and now paste where you want okay so we just copied our cell and our checkbox is already copied here okay another way to copy a checkbox is first select it control select and then press control and drag it you can see we just copied our checkbox here now let's move the checkbox right click on the cell click on cart and then paste where you want we can move our checkbox in this way another way to move is control select and then drag it and move it okay another way is that and pressing the right click you can move click on move here so this way you can move your checkbox now we should click on paste layout and here you can see selection pane if you click here you can see all the checkbox are listed here click on any of the name and press ctrl a all the checkbox has been selected now click on align and you can click on align left all the checkbox will be aligned left so this is how you can align okay now if you need to group all the checkbox click on the group and select this one group all the checkbox is grouped okay now an important trick here if you select the group copy it and paste it you can copy the entire group of checkbox here okay now that our checkboxes are ready now let's learn how we can link it to cell because if you don't link the checkbox to cell it won't do anything it will simply check mark and uncheck but we need to link all this checkbox to a cell now right click on the checkbox select from control and then cell link if you click here and select the cell and press enter press ok again now this checkbox is linked to this cell click here you can see here true if you uncheck it and it will say false okay now there is another way to link cell with checkbox just select the checkbox and in the formula bar write the cell reference with equal to equal to and then you can select the cell press enter it also does that if you click here you can see the checkbox are working right click on this checkbox and click on format control and here we have a 3d shading if we check this and also let's link the cell here if i click ok you can see we have a 3d effect on this checkbox okay it looks different than all the others okay now let's click here format control and let's see what we can control here first we have colors and line you can add fill color 
you can add transparency line color etc you can change the checkbox size from this option protection you don't need right now properties here we have move but don't size with cell and if we select don't move or size with cell whatever you do your checkbox will not move or resize it doesn't matter if you hide or move your cell it will stay in the same location okay alter text if you want any alter text you can do that here and the control option you already learned that and the first value if you want it to be checked it will always be checked now link the cell click here and if we click ok and you can see the first item is already checked by default it will be checked if we uncheck here you can do that okay now let's delete this checkbox select the checkbox and press delete you can delete that if you simply delete the cell your checkbox will not be deleted if you want to delete all these checkbox at once you'll have to go to the selection pane and you can click anywhere and then press ctrl a all the checkbox are selected now click on delete all the checkbox has been deleted okay so this is how you can create edit delete move copy link your checkbox to a cell now there is a problem here if you need to create multiple checkbox that means let's say you want to create 200 checkbox and creating them one by one is really disturbing and another problem is alignment whenever you create a checkbox placing them in a perfectly aligned way is really tough and whenever you resize your cell this checkbox will move okay another problem of checkbox is that you will have to manually link cells to each checkbox okay and in the next tutorial i'm going to create a vva and when you run the vva it will automatically create multiple checkbox based on your selection let's say you select a 10 cell you will get 10 checkbox all of them are linked to the cell you want at once no need to link them manually also they are perfectly aligned to your cell and the most important thing you will get in there is that if you resize your cell your checkbox will stay in the same way inside your cell it will not move or it will not destroy your alignment okay that's you are going to see in the next tutorial i hope you like this tutorial and i really want you to watch the next tutorial this is what i wanted to show you thank you thanks for watching see you in the next tutorial don't forget to subscribe thank you thanks for watching